I am so bound by my family, my past, my present, and the future. They instilled an ambition in me to get better, not by comparing myself to other people, but always striving to improve today's plight through hard work and an education. For I alone am responsible for my own destiny. The way to do that is to always surround yourself by people who make you better and inspire you to reach higher and farther. I got married young and dumb at 19 against my mom's wishes. My lifelong ambition was for college and great adventures. Mom felt a family would kill that dream. But spite drove me to prove her wrong. I graduated four years after finishing high school. I took an eight year break to get better at being a parent, but even then I had to do better. My mom watched during the days that I worked while I worked as a model in TV and films, but my family always remained my focus. Zahn Overby hired me to work at Kimbark, and together we opened North Vertimont. I remained close friends with my buddies from that past while building new friends for the future. Even though in 2005 our politics differed, we always remained friends. My dad was the smartest man in the world, but he never finished high school. He taught me to write and have a great respect for education. Over the years, I've written grants for this school totaling close to a million dollars. It was all so our school would get better. I often write the grants in other people's names because it's not about me. It's about North Vertimont Elementary School getting better. My past created today's present, and it is in this present mode that I have to prepare for the future. My children have all graduated from college. Stephen got his master's degree from Redlands, volunteered for three years in the Peace Corps throughout Europe. These tiles in Sao Paulo inspired the murals that are in our garden. Currently, my grandchildren are the ones inspiring me. Brittany is a sophomore at JP College, and Christina Rose is a freshman at Grand Canyon University. In the year 2000, I was a semi-finalist in the NASA Teacher in Space program because I was inspired by James T. Kirk. Who knows, maybe someday I'll get there, but I know I'll never stop trying to get better. <music>